Hi, I'm Pauline. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to create a simple maze game with different levels. We create a new project. You can choose any main character as you want. I leave the cat. Just rename it. Let's change size. We will have more space for maze. And let's go to the backdrop and paint some levels. First, let's rename it with level 1. I choose a rectangle to fill with the color. You can also choose any color, but it's important to have one color for all the walls. Let's and this is your fantasy how you how you want to create your level. Okay, let's do be something like this. Okay, let's create movement for the cat. With the green flag clicked, of course we need forever block and if if k pressed, we will need to go up. We need to first point in direction where we want to go we want to go up so our arrow should looks on the up and move okay let's 10 steps okay let's duplicate if we go down we need to point in direction down and also move then go to right drag it to the right yes duplicate and left point in direction left and move 10 steps click on the green flag and try to control as you can see, our cat can move, but he's turning. Click here in direction and click on right, left. Yeah, it's bad. But I think our cat moving too fast. That's why I change not 10 steps, but 5 steps. When you change this number, it's increase or decrease velocity of the cat. Okay, yes, I think it's better. Great, but now our cat can move through walls. Let's fix it. We need another condition, another if. And the green flag click, we will forever check if all our walls has green color. So we will use this block touching color, click here, choose color and click on the wall. If touching color, our cat will go back. So we always make move five steps, but when we will touch the wall, we will make move minus five steps. Let's see. So I try to go, but my cat move back, and it seems like he's stay on the same place. 
see yeah I think it's great awesome so this is the first level of our game let's create a new one go to backdrops you can duplicate or just create a new one and change walls for example i would do something like this okay You can create everything you want, make it more or less difficult. All right. Also, we need door some doors on our level. Let's draw it with another color. I want to be brown so we choose rectangle choose another color on the first level i put door somewhere here okay on the level two i put this here okay so cat when the green flag clicked he should move here go to this position and also let's click on the backdrop when the green flag clicked we should switch backdrop to the first one So let's click our cat here, first level. And then we need to check if touching door, it means a touching color brown. We put touching color, choose color, click here. So if we touch in this. We need to go to the. We need to change backdrop to the next one, to the level two or three or so on. It depends how many levels you will draw. And cat should go again here. Let's try. You see, we change the level and the cat again the start point. And here's the new level. We go to the door and we back to the level one. But if you will draw more levels, you will continue to play. We can also add the things that you can collect during your game and um, create a score for example you can collect stars some food keys and so on i will show you how you can do this for example choose a sprite for example star and you put star here So when the red drop level one you show and if put of course in forever and the click and if 
attaching cat star heights also it can play sound let's check yeah great also if you want to count them you can create a variable let's call it stars on the grid like click your stars equal to zero and when you find we change stars by one you can duplicate stars and put them in different places if your backdrop switch to the level 2 or another one you can move them to another places or just hide i hope this video was useful for you write in the comments which maze did you create and share your projects see you soon bye